Hello there, this is Alex and in this video I will demonstrate and go over the three most important things to practice and keep in mind while you are playing the classical guitar. Now as you can see on the classical guitar the neck is wider and thicker than on all different kinds of guitars. So what you need to do is keep your thumb firmly in the back of the neck. You don't want your thumb sticking over the top when you're playing. And what this does, it increases your, your pressing strength of your fingers because it's harder to fret the classical guitar than any other kind of guitar. And this also increases your dexterity and flexibility in your fingers. So that will, that will aid, definitely come to your aid when you're performing a more difficult classical piece whenever you get to that level. Um, the second aspect here is in your right hand. You want your wrist to be straight at all times. You don't want your wrist to be cocked down like this or up like this. Because ergonomically speaking, this is your natural movement of your hand, a straight wrist. And if your hand is bent down like this, it'll bend your tendons in an unnatural way and create more wear and tear. And that will shorten the length of your guitar playing career. Something a lot of beginners do is you either use a rubber band or a hair tie put it on your wrist and have a ruler going down and you want you can focus on that practicing in front of a mirror to make sure your wrist is following that straight line. So number one, thumb behind the neck. Number two, straight wrist. And the third aspect is your posture. You want to be sitting up straight and if you don't have a stool like this, you need to get a foot stand and that'll help your left leg be higher than your right leg and that will create a 45 degree angle on the guitar and that's what you want because it will help you keep a straight wrist while you're playing. So these three aspects you need to keep in mind when you're practicing anything, scales, chords, or songs. And then once you get these three aspects down and they become second nature, then you'll, you'll have better form playing and it will be less taxing on your body. Now to demonstrate this, I will play a short etude by Fernando Sor. So as you can see, my wrist will be straight, my thumb will be behind the neck, and I will have good posture. <laughs> So you can, your speed will increase as your technique increases and that will allow you to play faster and more difficult pieces without harming your body and shortening your guitar playing career. Well I hope this video provided you with some good information. Um, this is Alex here and you should take lessons with me if you're living in the Tempe, Arizona area. Have a great day.